rifle shot. That was a rifle. This might be the most dangerous thing that we've ever done in our lives. We do stupid things for, you know, for the content. Oh yeah. This takes the cake, hands down. Ben and I are in a town, very, very small town. It's, it's basically a ghost town. There's still people living here, but a lot of what's happened in the recent, you know, years has led up to, you know, even being more of a ghost town. And uh, to put it, I don't, I don't really want to sugarcoat this. Uh, I want to get straight into the nitty gritty of everything. This is a very racist town. Mm -hmm. um, it has a lot of things have happened here. Uh, we've done interviews today with the locals and they've told us how much they hate this group of people. Uh, to put it into perspective for you, we're going to go into this church in a sec. Right across the street from this church is the house that holds these KKK meetings to this day. Mm -hmm. They blast Hitler speeches at night. Mm -hmm. So a whole neighborhood could hear it. Can't sleep. Keeping the neighbors up Police to Hitler. do anything about it because it's free speech. Yep. It's insane. Yep. I'm going to be showing you guys articles. I'm going to be going into everything. Mm -hmm. um, it's crazy. Here's the thing. Within the first five minutes of Ben and I being here, a truck pulled up to us, said a racial slur, and then drove off. Mm -hmm. We're going to show you guys that in a sec, too. We got it all on camera. The people from that house were following us earlier. To the point where like Ben and I were so uncomfortable, we had to leave the area. We came back, obviously, to film and I'm not turning this down. No, you know, we you, love abandoned buildings, yeah. but this is church? my guilty pleasure. Oh, yeah. you love your churches. I love my churches. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but um, the thing is, like, we have to be really careful because some of the things that people have been saying that these people do is yeah. nuts. I mean, we've done a little research on our own and just by looking at some uh, social media stuff, Yes. He seems to have a uh, KKK getup that he's wearing in his profile picture. Yep. On certain social media pages, I'm not going to say where I don't want to. You know, don't get me wrong. I want to expose the oh, living hell out of this guy. Mm -hmm. I want to. That's why I'm doing this. Because someone brought this location up to us. And me and Ben were like, yeah, let's go check it out. You know, let's do some information. Mm -hmm. So we read a lot of stuff on Reddit. 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 We read, read it, it on, on Reddit. Reddit, bro. Sorry, um, we read it online, and we were like, "Yo, some of the this shit is crazy. Mm -hmm. It is nuts, bro." Mm -hmm. And I mean, for starters, I have this article pulled up right here. I'm gonna read you this right now, so <laughs> just get ready, okay? So long, long article. And when me and Ben read this earlier, like my stomach was like in a knot. Mm -hmm. Ben was Ben got really, you know. I mean, here's the thing. <sighs> I didn't even tell you guys. We literally made ourselves targets earlier. Obviously, we know what these guys believe in and stuff, right? Yeah, they make it pretty clear. Let me uh, just explain something quick. Ben yeah. showed up wearing a pride satchel. And although it is Pride Month, love Pride Month, you know, love the LGBT com uh, community. Mm -hmm. Amazing. The thing is, though, it's not Pride Month here. It's just June. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <It's> ju <laughs> Especially for those guys. It's, those guys it's, in particular, it's just June. June. Yes, it's the sixth of the year, you know? <laughs> not to make things... Ben's wearing a L. Ron Hubbard Scientology shirt. Yeah. Of, uh, if L. Ron Hubbard was a black male. Yep, so. black Scientology. Have you ever seen a skit on Eric Andre? It's like the funniest thing in the world. Uh, <laughs> even, when the... even when we're... Scientology is not what we should be worried about right now. No, though. really, though. No, <laughs> Scientology, like... Uh, um, <laughs> I'd rather have their car just pull up on us. Scientology on, right now. Oh, God, yeah. I'd feel kind of com comfortable with that. So I'm going to go ahead and get into reading this. I just want to say, if you guys are, you know, enjoying all this content lately... Smash the like button. Mm -hmm. uh, once this video reaches 13,000 likes, we're going to be dropping the next part of this video. We're going to be filming a whole series here. So tons of content for you guys. Um, every three to four days, you know, we're going to be dropping videos. Um, make sure to comment hashtag more Randonautica if you want more videos. Also, make sure to comment hashtag thanks, Ben, because Ben hey. came out here with me and um, I would not have wanted to have been out here alone. So big shout out to Ben. Hey, no problem. But here we go with the article. This is crazy. So this town... There were signs declaring white power and expressing anger towards minority groups. It led to complaints all over the village. The signs were placed on the front lawn of blank blank in the village. One sign said white power over what appeared to be in a triangle with two dashes inside of it. There was a sign with an SS symbol. The SS were a military force in Nazi Germany responsible for organizing the extermination of Jews and others under the regime of Hitler during World War II. Another sign listed profane terms for African Americans, gay people, and Jewish people, with Nazi swastikas and SS symbols flanking the word used for each group. 
all of which was written over the phrase F-U. The publisher, um, the article, uh, they're not going to post these images because their nature is too offensive. Mm -hmm. So basically, some people were posting this on Facebook and it went semi-viral. You know, yeah, a lot of people yeah. saw it. And apparently those people are saying that they got a lot of threats because of it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I don't condone threats of any kind because they do no, have children and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, but, yeah. but what they are doing is absolutely horrendous. Like, yeah. Disgusting, right? You throw stones and uh, someone might throw a stone back. Yes. Yeah. Well said. Um, it literally got so bad. This is what the sheriff said, the sheriff of the sheriff's department mm -hmm. here. The signs and what he says are protected under free speech, under the First Amendment. Mm -hmm. The guy is exercising his freedom of speech. And you know, if our office could literally do anything about it, we would. We think it's disgusting. And apparently that's his mentality about how things should be in this day and age. We wholeheartedly disagree. It's a donkey. Oh my God. Yeah, donkeys are <laughs> scary, man. Donkey. And then um, there was also a bridge that he drew a bunch of racist symbols and you know phrases on them and stuff like that so mm -hmm. this is the guy we're dealing with right uh you also said that his face social media profile picture is him in a kkk getup. yeah yeah okay. fun yeah that's it's insane that's so, Halloween costume, bro. um literally the mayor of the village said i'm a mayor of the village that has over a hundred years of jewish history the reason this village exists is because of its jewish population and holocaust survivors who were paid by the west german government to come here after world war ii mm -hmm. the signage is offensive on so many levels because of our jewish heritage it has a huge lgbtq community my best friend and community of the blank where he works at is african-american so this just hits me on so many levels it's crazy it is crazy you know and like i do believe in free speech but i believe that is you know there, there's boundaries to things yeah i'd almost i'd almost pop it in life with like disturbing the peace it is it, it's, like, it's like it's like it's like that level of like eh, it's no no it is yeah no no there's no eh, the peace. it is it is yeah yeah, guys, so um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you guys what happened earlier because all of that led up to where we are now and what's happening now. So you're going to go ahead and see them following us. You're going to go ahead and see the everything. So get ready. Strap yourselves in. Uh, ben and I are going to go in here. So you guys are going to see that later on in the video. Uh, get ready. It looks sick. Um, oh, I'm I will ready. tell you that we did come here earlier in the day and we heard a bunch of things. So we left and we were like, you know, maybe we should come here when it's sundown mm -hmm. because, you know, then we'll more low key. Yeah. Call it a day. So. All right, let's roll. Let's do it. Ready? I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. Are you rolling? Yeah, bro. Dude, I do not feel comfortable right now. Not at all. All right. A lot's happened in the past couple minutes, and there's a black cat crossing the road. That's literally like a bad sign, too, I think. That is not a great, um, a okay. great omen, if you will. Okay, so I'm going to play something here first, a clip from down the street right there. So around this bend, bend we just recorded something. Um, it was a very bad way to start the day, actually. So I'll place that first. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's that type of time. Here, can you hold this? Yeah, I got you. Okay. Bro. Yeah, you want to explain what just happened? I can't even say it on YouTube because, like... Obviously, you guys have seen the intro already, so you know that we are in a very... Uh, different? Diff we're in a very racist town. Yeah. Very racist town. And someone just drove by in a truck. Very beat down old truck. Stopped right in front of us and instead of a uh, racial slur. And then just drove off. Nice. So that's how we started this video off. Um, like I said, guys, we're... I don't want to say we're putting ourselves in danger for this video. Because we obviously know our limits. We're not going to put ourselves in a crazy... Yeah, we are. Put ourselves yeah, in very so. stupid situations. But the thing is, like... I didn't expect to start off today like that. No. Jeez, alright. Well, we're headed to our point right now. And our first um, intent right now is small town hidden secrets. You know, you guys all know that like almost all small towns have like this crazy story attached to some folklore or whatever mm -hmm. it may be. So that's what we're trying to find right now. Small town hidden secret. We have about a half mile walk. After that happened, uh, we kept walking down the street because we had about a half mile to walk to our point. That's actually right here. Um, our intent is... Uh, Small town hidden secrets. Mm -hmm. I like this one because obviously, 
you know, small towns always have those like weird stories attached to them. Yeah, Whether it's yeah, like yeah. some creepy folklore story that only like that city knows, mm -hmm. or it's something deeper, darker from within, right? Mm -hmm. It brought us to this, and I'm. I can tell you right now, no one's living in this. And if no they way. Are, I think the only thing living in this is probably some ticks, maybe some raccoons. Maybe. Um, after that truck thing happened, I didn't. Yeah, can, you, can you can you explain? Well, I explained a little bit in that clip, but basically, <laughs> pulled up next to. I don't even want to say it. Yeah. Just because, like, I'm already having issues with YouTube demonetization. It's, I don't, yeah, I don't want it. So, don't basically, it. a slur. And um, here's the thing. This this city itself, you, you explained it a little bit better. So, you explained this a little bit better. Yeah. Um, what exactly was, like, going on? So, uh, essentially, the biggest thing was, um, like, almost like a growth of, of issues and racism. Like, I mean... I know uh, a town nearby had a lot of flyers for like the KKK and um, a lot of other bad groups. Right. Um, and the rumors that we heard is the guy's looking at us right now. Really? Bro, he just walked out in the street, looked at me, and then walked walked back. In. And okay, and the house that he's at in particular, you want to explain that a little bit? Yeah. So that house um, is kind of crazy. It has. Uh, it has two S's in uh, like the the bolt S. Yeah. Um, which stands for SS. It's carved um, into his house. Yeah, yeah. Or it's like a little like fixture. Yeah, it's yeah. like on the house. It's a permanent fixture. So yeah, they were staring us down when we walked by, and, and that was mad uncomfortable. And I literally, I was so uncomfortable. I didn't want to take the camera. Walking, right There's someone walking towards us right now. Like no joke. Okay, I, I didn't feel comfortable, like, actually, I'm going to keep the camera rolling in case they say something. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I didn't feel comfortable when we were walking by because they were staring at us so hard, so I just took a bunch of selfies, like, I was taking a bunch of selfies, and in every selfie, if I zoomed in, they were standing there, staring at us, mm -hmm. mugging us hard. Mm -hmm. I'll put this on screen, it's crazy. And, okay, they literally just walked up to us, towards us. And then she's walking back now. Not good vibes at all, bro. This is our point. I know. I thought we had to do something to help her, you know. Bro, th this is insane. I know. I, I wasn't. I wasn't joking. So Ben, uh, yeah, and turned right into that house. Yeah, that's where it is. That's the house. Yeah. And that lady was on her phone earlier we at the porch too. I, I was. <laughs> it's, this is a hot spot it's like a wi-fi hot spot yeah dude. we are it's, going on a 5g right now yeah so here's the thing like if we go into this house right now they're, they're gonna call the cops but here's the thing about this area there was no cops, there no cops. <laughs> <laughs> so there's that um so then they, it would have to be a state trooper that's probably gonna have to make like a 30 minute drive. our our biggest worry is that this guy goes into uh here uh v vigilante batman style yep and just thinks, I gotta do this myself. Oh, that's from over there. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what? No, no, what? No, bro. Okay, so bro, this may be crazy. This may be a crazy mm -hmm. idea. Mm -hmm. I say we walk back towards our car, keep the camera rolling, and see if by any chance they, say they talk to us or say anything. Hell yeah. What do you think about that? I say it's a goal. I think it's, I think it's a win. Okay, because this is a little bit hot right now. Yeah, I'd say we do this when they're not fucking staring at Yeah, us. maybe another day, because we're going we're gonna to be here for a while. Yeah, so. and we actually have another spot we were going to hit earlier. Anyways, yeah. Anyways, so. Damn, that's a shame. Look at this place. Mm -hmm. It looks like they were trying to fix it. Mm -hmm. And then just kind of like gave up on it. But, hey. Here we go. Um, I'm going to have the camera down and basically just recording. And uh, whatever happens, happens. Mm -hmm. Cool. It's a shame we have to start the video off like this, guys. But yeah, bro. We had we had, we had good plans. The thing is, like we we knew we knew what we we're gonna get ourselves into, and if we could play it safe, uh, we're gonna play it safe ten yeah. out of ten times. So guys, things are hot right now in the world, and people feel like they need to do stuff or whatever, and. Those types of people can be very dangerous, so. So, um, please bear with us. We're probably going to generate a new point, and we'll see you guys there. Peace. Ben, is that them right there? They're in the middle of the road right now. 
Is it? It might be. It might be. Uh, I can't really tell. I know. I mean, can we turn around? I know the road, right? Uh, you can. The road is so narrow. Yeah. Ah, dear God. Oh, God. I just turned the lights on in the car. Oh. Okay. okay. Uh, ben? Yep. I got you. You keep recording. I'll keep driving, alright? Yeah. Oh, shit. I might have just intimidated them. Or... What do I do? I can't... All right, Ben, just make sure to get that on camera just in case, okay? Yeah. Like, even if it's for, like, a split second, mm -hmm. just so we have documentation. You know what I mean? I get you. Okay, he's in the room. That's him. That's him. That is him. That's him. staring at us. Yeah. That's that's literally them. How did they know we were here? I don't know, dude. Okay, so Ben and I were like that those people they're getting in the car. If they start following us, like, we really have to, like... Ben and I stayed here overnight. <clears throat> and we were literally saying to each other, let's not play Rayonautica in that general area mm -hmm. in, like, the off chance that, like, you know... I mean, at the end of the day, bro, those people are scared. You don't know what these people are capable of. Yeah. You catch them on a bad day, God, you know, God yeah, exactly. knows. exactly. Exactly, bro. And like we go in the outskirts, like we're we're in like we're in like a state park right now or something mm -hmm. like that. Yeah, yeah. And there's like these trails and stuff you could uh, drive in and whatnot. And I was like, Yo, Ben, let's go play around Nautica on the outskirts for a while. What are the odds that they're there? Literally know, the bro. second we get here. I know. How crazy is that? We're in the same fear and everything. You think they're scary on at like their property? Imagine the forest. Yeah, yeah that's where I don't want to catch them. No. All right, maybe we should go back into town. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think it probably is. Well, now we know they're here. Yeah, I'd say it's... maybe one or two. Since we're already all the way here, I'd say maybe one in ten, two in ten, we call it a day. Yeah, fair. But, like, this is a little too much. Um, we'll see you guys at the point. Our point right now is controversial topics, controversial events. So anything of the sorts that if we were to find, cool. Um, we'll see you guys at our point. Okay, so we're pulled the camera out right now that same car was just up there at that bend and when we pulled up here we went to go grab the camera we heard two doors close and they drove off now here's the thing my point is legit right there i mean i can't do much right now because i have no internet connection so mm -hmm. it's you know but our point is like right up there where that bend is to the right so now like you know how we say like the off chance that like these things are like pre-placed or whatever yeah i mean it feels like it a lot. Sure, doesn't it? Yeah. Jeez. It sounds crazy. Yeah, it's crazy to think that this place is like literally on the outskirts of this town. Like it's right, right there. Oh, I just saw something. Oh yeah, I did. Look. Oh wow. It's, it's like a teepee. Oh yeah, it is. That's cool. Here, uh, points somewhere in that direction. So I'm gonna pull over real quick. Oh. We'll just assume this is our point at this point. I mean, like, at this point. Teepee. Well, I can't do much because I don't have service. You don't have service. I know. So we're just. Yeah. All right, you ready? Controversial topics, it. controversial events. Let's roll. Let's do it. I can only imagine. I can only imagine. No, I was in the car still. What's up? All right, you know what? Maybe it's better. And do you have sh pockets? Yeah. yeah I, wore, I wore running shorts today in case we had to run from those uh, people. Uh, <laughs> so I'm, I'm ready. I wore tight jeans. Let's do it. <sighs> Let's go. 
Yeah, I just don't wanna. You're the one in tight jeans. <laughs> I don't want you to. Damn, this looks like it goes on for forever. But there's uh, there's stuff in it. I see some things on the floor. Oh, there is. Uh, bro, it looks like a a leg. A leg? Uh, hold on. Can you grab that for a sec? What kind of leg? Like a chicken leg. Uh, you know? Ooh, chicken legs? Uh, it looks like a. Yeah, I saw little toes. Well, let's say, uh, air, uh, air raid sign. Air raid, yeah. Why? Does that mean that there's air raid? I hope not, bro. Hey. It was good working with you, man. Likewise, bro. What goes on in this damn town? I know! <laughs> These silent hills. This is creepy. It is creepy. Here's my phone, bro. I I'm sorry. You. I'm. Anything else? <laughs> no, actually. I left my wallet in the car. Yeah, see, that's what I saw. I saw the little toes. Oh, yeah, it is a. Uh, something. I see like a message in a bottle. There's something over there. There's all types of things going on. How do you there. even get in there? It looks like it's completely wrapped. Oh. A little door for us. Oh, nice. I'm dead serious. Should we genuinely like, be worried about that siren? Or... It's still going on. It might. The camera might not be picking it up. That's weird. Sigma. Oh! It's a lens. There's no lens in here. Just keep on, just keep on going. That cursive, that's cursive. Oh, great. Our worst enemy. <laughs> I'm okay with it. Some letters still throw me off. I told you what someone sent me in my mail the other day. It was a uh, English to cursive, like oh huge, thick gosh. book. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I, oh, well, are you ready? Mm -hmm. May 21st. So over a month ago, we're in July now. May 21st, I no longer feel accepted by my family. Everyone is treating me like shit. I'm sick and tired of this effing town. What's that? I don't know. Um, I'm sick and tired of this effing town. I'm planning on leaving. I'm trying to convince my boyfriend to leave with me, question mark. There is a rumor that the house with the 1,000 pound lady is officially abandoned. The house with the 1,000 pound, pound lady. lady. That's... For backstory, yeah, that's... Is that like a TLC show? No, no that's my 600 pound life. Go on, go on. Okay. I'm actually kind of... For backstory, this lady was so damn big that she could only get into the house through the double doors. She was legit 1,000 pounds... Or so they say. The house is slanted towards the direction where she spent most of her days sitting in. I don't know what happened, but her plus her kids left the house. My boyfriend and I are going to stay there until we decide what to do. Bro, I've been to that house. 150%. I have to hear more of it to, to make sure. The house with the double doors? Yeah. That was the house we tried to get into the other day. Oh, the one where the people literally found us on the street. Yes, that That's is the, the exact same. That is the, I, a story like that, how could you, how could you forget like, she was a, a thousand pounds. You know the story? Yeah. Yeah. So legit a thousand pounds. Well, I don't know if it was a legit thousand, but she was heavy. And uh, they had to, you know, make a double door. I'm saying legit now because this person says legit in every single sentence. Oh, wow. But yeah, continue, sorry. No, yeah. They had to uh, add like a, uh, a whole um, double door for her to get through because she was that like massive. And if you look at the staircase, it was double graded, like steel, mm -hmm. like because, because they had to like make sure. She and yeah, the house was, now that I think about it, the house was tilted to the back. Everything felt like it was going to the back. And there was this huge chair in there for, uh, for her. Bro, so now I'm wondering, because we're not that far from that house. We're, we're not. just on the outskirts of the city. Exactly. Like we're legit probably... 
five minutes away. About five minutes, yeah. My boyfriend and I are going to stay there until we decide what to do. The first mite here... What? Oh, the first night here, someone else tried to get into the house. I think they heard my boyfriend and then scurried off. In the morning, we saw a gas container plus matches from where the people were trying to come into. I think they were going to try and burn this house down. It may not be safe to stay here after all. This town is up to no good. They are hiding something. Every Sunday... What's the date today? Every oh, Sunday, okay. yeah. they host something at night inside of Welshman's Barn. It is wrong. It is dark. It is inhumane. And then she has some things written. Hold on, hold on. What? Oh. Huh? What? I thought I heard something, but it was a mosquito in my ear, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wait, hold, on. hold up one sec. Bro, there's some things written here. This isn't in cursive, but sacrificum in quotations. Okay. Query, sanguis, mm. oxcord, auxilium. I'm sorry. Auxilium. I feel like I've seen some of those words before. Sacrificium. Sure. Sacrificium's like, kind of sounds like sacrifice. Huh. And if they're holding <laughs> yeah. something dark in these barns, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that one out there. Context clues. If yeah. you guys have any ideas, <laughs> like Zoinks, let us like know. Like Zoinks, scoop. <laughs> um, in a Sigma case, I was kind of hoping to find a lens, but I know. Even though my camera doesn't even take Sigma lens, I don't think it's a Sony. Camera. I mean, you could resell it, or you could get a Sigma camera. Yeah. All right, back in I go. Gun shells. That's fun. Ah, uh, classic. Leg. leg. There's a box that says counter blessing. Leg. What's up? Oh, I just pointed the camera to the leg and said leg. Is that a Molotov? Or like a wannabe Molotov? It looks like it's a letter in a box. A message in a bottle. It's a song, dude. Okay. You were getting beaten up by the thing on the way out. You got you got some on you got your little piece hanging on you. There you go. Oh, that was my hair. <laughs> <laughs> Count your blessings. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh, that's where the notes came from. Oh, there's more notes in here. Um, and a clock. Hmm. Count your blessings. There's a clock. Uh huh. There we go. What yeah. does that mean? I. I guess we better start counting them. We left the house and went into the woods. Continues. Same paper and everything, you could tell. The area is okay, but be warned, the deeper you go, the more effed up it gets. That's what she said. Yeah, we've sure. What? We found human remains in the lake. We have to call Jesus. the police now. Jesus. Bro, what did we just find? We just found this... We just found this diary in the forest that says, We found human remains in the lake. We have to call the police now. Update. We called the police. They're taking it from here. Okay, that's expected. They know, they know, they know, they know, they know, they know, they know. That's it. Mosquitoes. Do I I'm sorry if I shake the camera weird every once in a while, guys. I'm being attacked right now. Uh, My heart is like... Yeah, that's... Count your blessings. Uh, all right. And uh, the genie in the bottle. I'm freaked yeah. out right now. Did you see a lake? I didn't. I didn't either. I'll check the maps in this. Ugh. There's What's in there? Critter in there. Yeah. That's his home. This is his home. Sorry, pal. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Oh boy. What we have here? Say like you're reading a magazine. Wait, hold on, what is that? Is that a what's his name? Yeah, it is. 
Oh dear God. Well, there's a controversy. What? Eugene and Beatrice stood with their father, Prince Andrew, uh... at a 2016 event, but were devastated by his sex scandal. There's our controversy. That was a, uh... John John's Last Day Alive. Wait, John John's? Yeah. Who's John John? Gripping final moments before JFK Jr. Oh! Plunged to tragic death with wife and sister-in-law. That. I didn't even... I'm not trying to be uneducated. I really didn't even know there was a JFK Jr. Yeah, I, I knew there was a... I don't know. You know, anything besides that he exists. Mind if I see that? Yeah, I don't know if I see Wow. Superstar Tom Cruise promotes his blockbuster film. Oh. The number one Scientologist on the planet. If we, if there's ever a con, like a controversy that aligns with us and the shit we do, it's a, of course a Scientologist, right? Yeah, turn that open the wine. That's insane. That's actually insane. Crazy, and you're not bro. wearing your Scientology shirt. I'm today. not wearing it today, sorry guys. All right. So what do we take away from this? We found notes literally leading up to remains in a wet lake here. Yeah, which lake though? This is like forest. Uh, we just heard like an air raid one. Yeah, that was kind of weird. I, I don't know what that is. That, could that be a tornado warning? I doubt it. It's beautiful today. I mean, I know, I know some areas use like they have like the air raid sirens for different things or whatever. Like I know when I used to live, in one time when I was a kid, they used it, that exact sound for like two minutes when it hit noon. That sound would go off. Like, that would be fun for everyone. So, like, I get sometimes have their things, but, like, I haven't heard anything since we've been in the area. Right, or yesterday. And also, it, didn't, it wasn't a time thing. I checked my time. We weren't on any, like, dot. We weren't on, like, 7 o'clock or 7.15. It was, it's like, just, a it's weird. It's just a little weird to me, considering the fact that those people were just here. Yeah. Like, legit just here. I know. I'm almost considering taking that book with me because of the shit that's inside of it. I mean, I probably take the book at least. The other stuff, I mean, I think that's like, that is a controversy. I think it's a magazine though, or something. And then that's the leg, definitely from a magazine. But the thing is, what are the odds? I don't have a use for a leg. Either. That there's like three controversies on there. Each thing is its own. I know. Yeah. Well, I, in I a bottle, say, and a message in a bottle too. I'm, unless we're missing something else here, are we missing something else? I mean, it's, like, is there a bigger picture that we're missing? And we're just supposed to enjoy the. Uh, I, you can't with the mosquitoes. Yeah, you can't. You're right. <laughs> Count your blessings. There's a clock. I'm almost thinking like this is all tying in together. I mean, you got that one thing pretty quick with like the count your blessings and the clock being connected. It makes, Thanks. It makes I, sense. I mean, the least I could do it. <laughs> um, there was the notes in here as well. So, it said they weren't accepted by their family. They weren't accepted by their family in this town. So her and her boyfriend moved to. That abandoned house that we literally this is all like too much though the yeah. coincidences are too much it, it's it, it's we weird were at the house that yesterday. we were just there so now i'm wondering like if we went into that house what else would we have found because you were in that house like weeks ago i did yeah ben was the i was the uh original uh investigator this is all too much it is from the car literally being everything there. between yesterday and today i i, I want to be uh, I'm like, like genuinely like after what happened in the church yesterday. You guys are gonna see that after the fact, but after everything is just all so much right now. I'm gonna keep this because I don't know. Maybe 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 we'll find more to this or something. Yeah. I, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. If we're missing something out of anything that we just found, please let us know down in the comment section below. I, mean, I will say when I was in there too, one other thing I noticed is it did look like it was lived in after like that did that was a vibe i oh, got like did there was there? yeah that there was stuff that didn't make sense there uh bottles and stuff you know drinks okay. that type of stuff you know so from what i understand they were there for a couple nights so that because remember they said someone tried breaking in yeah or getting in to burn the place down or something yeah yeah which also makes you wonder why are they burning it down like what is going on in this house I don't know. Look. so many like i'm telling you bro small towns have the craziest secrets they the hidden do. secrets and it's easier to get away with stuff in a small town. Because, I mean, there's no police department. Yep. But then they said they called the police, so... Well, you can call the police. Oh, yeah, it's like, state... town. It just goes over. Oh, okay. This means it's going to take them longer to get to you. Which can be kind of scary sometimes. Depending That's how far away you are. Think about. It is. Here, I'll grab the camera. 
Wow, nice jump. Thanks. I am wearing my running shorts, so. All right, um, I'll be honest. I don't, these bugs are insane. I don't know how it's much bad. more I want to play in this forest, barring all the bugs and whatnot. So we're going to, wait, listen. Car, car's coming. All right, yeah, I don't, maybe one or two more points and we'll get the hell out of here. Yeah. Cool. All right, guys, we'll see you at our next point. Well, we're back in town now, and we're actually on the same church or street as the, where that church was, yep. which means we're on the same street as where those people are. But to be fair, we're a little farther down. We, we are, did, we are taking it's some precautions. Road, but it says our points here on the left and half a mile. So of course, it brings us to the same road again. Literally, same exact road. Whew. My stomach's like curling up right now. Is that because the foul smell of shit in the air or? Yeah, I think it's the manure. I'm going to close the window. Yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. All right, so 0.3 miles. There's literally like nothing here, though. Look up. Like, it's just. Yeah, this is a barren road. And my high beams are on, too. Oh, actually, if I zoom in on the point, it looks like there's a building. Oh, there is. Yeah, I'm going to close this quick. Oh, wait. Yeah, there is a that building. one. Schoolhouse. This is the schoolhouse. Oh. Yeah, it's boarded up to shit, so uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know if that's you have a flashlight I can see for a second? Um uh, I don't know where you put yeah, that one. I had one second. I had one as well. Oh here it is. Hey, listen. Alright. That's weird. You have to hold it. Oh yeah, yeah. I see upside down chairs. Oh, the top windows. Oh, that flashlight's doing that thing, just so you know. It's all good. Yeah. Top windows busted out. Is it? Yeah. Oh, we're not climbing that. Gunshot. In the distance. Yeah. You hear it? Yep. It's like really far. I doubt the camera's picking it up. I don't know if I can leave my car here because it's an intersection. Hold on. It's I'm gonna be a better probably spot. Park over here. Here's your flashy lady. Thank you. They look all the windows are boarded, bro. Yeah. So, uh huh. Our intent is behind closed doors. Oh. So what well, is behind these closed doors? Let's go find out. Let's go find you don't? Out. Yeah, let's do it. You know we won't ever pass down a, oh, yeah. a bando. Let's go check this out. I'm gonna grab my flashlight. Oh. oh. It's like an iPad wallpaper. Oh. All this grass is. Oh, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. Odds that someone's living in here? Oh, none. Jesus, a donkey. Oh, scared no, the living that hell out of me. Fucking donkey, bro. They better not be shooting the damn donkey. It's gonna sound like the gunshots are like thudding. No, no, that's def. That actually sounds like. Hold on. No, that's gunshots. That's like way, way off. Yeah. Bro, that's crazy. Oh look, the windows busted. Oh yeah. Yeah, this place is. And this has seen some better days. I'd say. Is this like a storage like the church as well? I shouldn't say that. <laughs> Spoiler alert. That's <laughs> locked. Yeah, look, yeah. there's just upside down chairs and whole TV. Interesting. Bro. Alright. 
trying not to freak out. Look at this board. That board's seen better days, let alone the freaking place. Yeah. I thought there was like a door behind it or something. <laughs> I can confirm this. You think my car is going to be okay just sitting with it? Uh, I think this road doesn't see enough action. Oh, you look over here. There's like a uh, missing. Oh, cool. Take a look at that. I'll look over here. Oh, that. What? Hey, take a look at that first. Okay. Let me know if it's cool. I'm just trying to see if there's like maybe a way in. That doesn't work, I think I found Whoa. It. Frog. Uh, What's it not you. Oh, it was a cricket. <laughs> There's a basement, I think. Whoa. <laughs> no, no, keep coming, keep coming. Whoa, is that a way in? It looks like it, brother. Oh, just our luck. Ow. Oh, just our luck. You wearing your Crocs? Of course. Of course. Are doing this? Ah, hell yeah, bro. I hope not. Your lights are still on. I mean, I guess it's probably a good thing. You got your emergencies. Ooh, careful. Those stairs are made in 1812. Yeah, there's poop here. Nice. What is that thing? It's Wait, like there. a baby carriage. Hey, there's a car. There's a car. Oh. Never mind. I thought I... Sorry, guys. It looks like a baby carriage with like a with spikes. You seen that? It's like a baby carriage. It's probably what they those used to people kill... raise their baby in. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, there's no doorknob. Oh. Oh, well, it's wow, a push yeah, open. Bolted shut. No. Imagine. <laughs> That was the first time that's ever happened in my life. Yeah. I'm... I didn't even say hello that time. They said it first. Someone's in there. Someone's living in here. I mean, hey. Uh, I mean, homeless were... But there's no door. Yeah. I've never had an instant... Someone's in here. I'm my my only question is, this is clear in the event. Wait a second, Ben. Think about it. There's no doorknob on that. It's bolted shut. The front has a lock, but on the outside. Right? Yes. Is this person yeah, okay? it's sketchy. Is this person okay? What if it's like a, uh... Yeah, because... Bro, because, like, here's the thing. I, I haven't heard anything since. And when I was like... a kid... I'll give you an example, bro. When I was a kid, I my sister had this one toy. And it used to say, like, hello. But it only happened when you got near it. Because then it would move a little bit. It'd trigger the button. Right, right, right. And it'd go off. What if it's, like, a toy or something? Like, like an storage, alarm. Like a toy alarm. Or, like, a toy alarm or something. Like... But like, I don't want to think that there's someone bolted up in there's here, no bro. There's no anyone's in here. There's like a... A cave... Oh, like, hold on. Wow. Oh, yeah, that's definitely like... Oh, no, they're all nailed. Like, completely... Yeah, there's no way in. There's... No. My only... Because you can't lock yourself in from the... Or out from the inside. No. Because of this. The lock looks Wait. new. You can dance. You can dance. Have been the time of your life. Why is Mama Mia playing? Bro, this is creepy. Yeah, Mama Mia's the playing. Fuck? And there's something moving in the distance. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not feeling this right now, Jess. Motion on my front. I have missed calls. I have missed calls. I didn't realize like that. Then the... I have a bunch of missed calls. What? I have. No color ID, no color ID, no color ID, no color ID. No color ID, no color ID, no color ID. These were all... How long, how long ago? About five, six minutes ago. And I, it doesn't go through because I have... Robocal. Call screening app, yeah. Sorry. Interesting. Oh, there's a door right there. Look in. There's a door. There is. But I'm upstairs. 
Hey, is anybody? Do you need help? Are you good in there? Okay. Okay. That is a rifle shot. That was a rifle. Uh, this is freaking me out, bro. bro Hold on, what we gotta. The, fuck? the wires are cut. There's no. There's nothing going in here, bro. This place is completely cut off from power grid, everything. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we hear you. We we know you're in there. Do you need help? Is the question. Ben, does this. If they did, wouldn't they say it by now? I feel like we're being fucked with. Uh, I'm getting a phone call. From who? No caller ID. Here. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay, that's a little weird that both of us did get one, but... Hello? Hello? Is it... Nope. Hello? It's, it's, hang up. It's just weird that both of us got one. Getting another one. Are you really? Hello? Yo, who is this? Anybody there? Hello? Alright, here's this, bro. I'm gonna. There's a car coming. In the distance? I just, the headlights are coming this way. Just the headlight. What's this? Zip ties. In... Why are they like Bend that? Bend the car. Hold on, hold on. Just in case, right? Let's just be near the car? Yeah. Okay, you, see Whoa. Oh, you see it? Fuck. You see it? It's coming. I'm getting another call, bro. What the f***? What is going on right I'm, now? I'm, should I even answer it? There's just no, dead just, air. just hang it. I think we should be more worried about this car that's coming. Yeah. What about these zip ties? What are these... Don't, okay, I on. don't, zip ties don't do ben. that normally. I'm sorry, I'm just, we just heard a rifle coming from that distance yeah. and a car is coming this That's, time. bro, you know what house is down there, right? Yes, the bad house. Yes. We're on that street right now. Yes. And we're hearing yes. all types of things. From that way. Yeah, I don't, that's freaking me out, that's freaking me out, but also... It's just weird. We just got a hello and a couple knocks and that's it. So I'm thinking now is like, are they just toying with us? That's what I've been thinking, bro. Well, we heard the rifle coming from the direction. Of the direction. The where those people live. The, those who shall not be named. Also, the music stopped. It's like they played that one song and that's it. But why that song? I know, hold on. What was, which, which Mamma Mia song was it? I don't know. <laughs> it was, uh... Guys, I'm not the biggest ABBA fan, guys. You'll have to let me know which one it was. I think the reverbs can uh, help you with a copy strike, copyright. I don't think you'll get hit. Oh, I hope. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> I'm not even bother. Honestly. They probably did it on purpose just to copyright strike you, bro. And then... Is that car? I'm telling you, it's like a machine or like a that was, right. That was something. Something shooting. Because if it was fireworks, those trees are covering nothing. We would see the fireworks. Exactly. <laughs> I hate this place. <laughs> I don't want to be here dude. anymore. But why? Hold on. Did I get any more phone calls? Because it doesn't go through. I did to simply see them. No, I, I got five. You got three? Yeah. Oh, someone who has both of our numbers. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Down? Yeah. Um, we'll be back. Uh, we're gonna show you guys everything that happened last night at the church. That's crazy. And, uh, hope you guys enjoy. Alrighty, so... We weren't able to explore this place too much earlier. We got a little bit of content on our phones, but nothing like, you know, 
uh basically we were in there and we heard the front door start rattling like it yeah. was supposed to be unlocked and that's when we were like yo we gotta get out of here yeah bro. and we went through the back and we just ran the literally the back door is unlocked yeah which so is wild it's just... insane but um our point brought us here and um i don't know <laughs> i don't know um we didn't really find anything that pertained to our point then my only thing is like what, what is the off chance that like those people like come in here or something like that B based on what we saw in there earlier you guys will see in a sec yeah um like things got so bad here like they they abandoned the church they abandoned a ton of diners they abandoned all sorts of things it is mm -hmm. nuts i mean <laughs> the door is just wide open right there so. oh yeah um Honestly, we might, I might close on the way out just to. Yeah, I almost feel bad. There's stuff in there, yeah. Um, cemetery here. Clearly, the cemetery's mowed, so someone is taking care of this. Which is not this, yeah. apparently not. No. I'm just worried about like what happened earlier, because when we ran out, we just ran down there and just like, we made a huge loop around. So I yeah, there's a bridge down there, and everything's wild. But now that we know that they literally didn't care enough to close the door, they did not. Making sure it's closed, you know, for our protection and everything, but I didn't even get to check out most of down here. Oh, there's a door over there, bro. Look at that. Oh, oh that's wild. Wow. It's like, okay, that's there's it. church pews and everything. So the thing is, is like, with our point, we, t we were only looking around for like five minutes. Yeah. Our point could be anywhere. Mm -hmm. It could be in the attic. Mm -hmm. It could, you know, we don't know. What? A snowmobile? It sure is. <laughs> Definitely is a snowmobile. That's a basketball hoop. Basketball hoop. Um, so yeah, it just looks like this place is almost like a storage. Yeah, that's what we kind of got from our own here. Was we might just use this for storage. Okay. I don't think light can shine through mosaic. We just light up like a Christmas tree. <laughs> the neighbors smell us. Is that a cat living? There's a cat living in here with us. Here, kitty, kitty. Church cat. Hmm? I mean, odds are we're gonna split up. You have your camera, phone. Yeah. Like, here, there's so much, basically, you guys could see, like, this place was, like, turning some type of storage, right? Now, is there a story attached to this? Is, you know, what's going on? I don't know, but that's mm -hmm. what we're here to find out. Yeah, yeah. You know, clearly there's shit is left for whatever reason, so. Um, there, that door over there is the one that we heard rattling earlier. So just take a look at that. I'm trying to see if anything moves in there. I don't think this place has uh, power, do you? There's only one way to find out, right? That's true. Still. Church is in school. <laughs> Church is in such a chair. I shouldn't have suggested that. You, <laughs> then you shouldn't have cooked me into it. If we, bro, that scared the out of me. If we didn't draw any attention to us yet, we just did. <laughs> we just saw the electric current. They're like, what the f? <laughs> National Grid just got the phone call, like, hey, the power just turned on in the uh, <laughs> uh, abandoned church for the first time in 17 years. <laughs> Use your bell. Someone go check. <laughs> Oh, no. Jesus. All right, well, let's not do that next time. We learned. Yeah, yeah. It dropped to the ground. Oh, yeah. <laughs> dropped that ass. <laughs> this is the, um... Oh, yeah, bro. Literally, it's just a... Yeah. That, so, yeah, they, they could have got in here, whoever was trying to. Could've. The thing is, we obviously realize that this place is used for storage.
I mean, the door's wide open. I mean, he yeah, won't really do is. anything. But that means I might shut Unless down. they forgot. I hope it isn't them. I know that someone said it down the road this way and down the road this way. This the only road down the road this way. Down the road this way is that house. So and it's right there. So it's like a one in three chance that that is the case. Ah, great odds for us. Yeah. I mean, it wouldn't seem like a bad place to get stuck, right? We got TV, we got it's true. a fridge over there. True. Power? I mean, now we have electricity. We know where you can make it scary work. electricity, but we got it. go check out some of these uh, rooms and stuff. You want to go check downstairs? Yeah, yeah, go check. All right, we'll split up. That way we can hopefully just get the hell out of here, get what we need to get done, and call it a day. So, I thought I just heard something. <laughs> I think I'm just paranoid. So this place is uh, sick. So. Oh, yeah, it's wild. Uh, good luck there. Thank you. Uh, Zoomed in on the shirt, so. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, Alright, this place is nuts. Hey, it looks like they were literally just selling this stuff off, but some of it just doesn't make sense. You know, like, I don't know. Like, there's a, a volleyball net. Um, it's over here. That's the thing, guys. Is with my intent being what it is, I don't know what I'm looking for. You know, there's clearly cookie cutters in here I just don't this all looks like someone's shit look at how many boxes you know at the end of the day this could be those people still no I don't know though that's for sale <laughs> uh, maybe it's just a, a shop but oh yeah. fridge works let me go check over there I uh don't know. I really don't know what to make of this. Uh. Oh, look at that. That's old. Has definitely seen better days. <sighs> oh shit, that's the window right there. <laughs> Let's put that on five percent. Because I was like, holy cow. That is safe. Press the safe. Oh my god. There's more paper. Hold on. Oh my god, they scared the shit out of me. Okay. Sorry, this is probably a lot different than what I'm used to on the channel. You know, we're used to going into the forest and stuff. Piece of paper. Lord, please protect my family from the demonic presence in this town. There are people who claim to praise your word, but are Lucifer in disguise. Please help our family in town. I gotta show this to Ben. Is there any more notes that was in the floor? Curious as to what's in that safe. I know you guys back home are like, check the safe. I mean, clearly this place has been abandoned for um, quite some time. That's not creepy at all. Oh shit, there's a car coming. I think it drove past. There's tons of mattresses here, just randomly. That's interesting. If there's any place that my intent is gonna pay off for, it's definitely in the safe. Let me check that. Ow. Lost gold. Oh, pool. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. That's clickbait, I suppose. Now, here's the thing. There is an attic, like a second floor. Let's go check that out. 
Wait a second. It's footsteps. That's legit footsteps. Oh, shit. oh there's someone upstairs. Oh god. second floor no I'm in the basement there's I think there's someone up there like I hear footsteps I know what footsteps sound like that's not an animal bro you swear you're in the basement I swear we're all in the basement right now wow uh, no, okay um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna probably check out you like mom or uh no you're good I'm Maybe I'm just hearing things. You know how I am, apparently. Sure, sure. Well, did you check out that door yet? Uh, yeah, I think it's a cabinet. It's sideways. Hmm, okay. Well, keep me updated if you find anything then. Yeah, I know, bro. All right, bro. I might actually go, I don't know. If I hear things upstairs, um, there's a ladder in there going up, I remember from earlier today. So, all right, bro, I'll see you. Are you, are you good with heights, though? I'm terrified of heights. Alright, bro. Will do. Alright, I'll talk to you later. See you, bro. Peace. Alright, peace. Mm. Alright, well. Clearly, there's something going on in this town from that note. Oh, I didn't tell Ben about the damn note. Not the note, sorry. I really gotta watch my mouth. Um. Oh, God. This place is crazy. Yo, what is that? Hold on. Do you guys see that? Look at that. not supposed to be creepy, but it is creepy. Oh, there's newspapers. August 30th, 2018. That's not too long ago. So, alright. Um, that's about it. Probably go meet back up with Ben soon. And then, um, I'll call it a day. Hello? Bro, are you upstairs? Yeah. Are you like up, 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 upstairs? No, I'm on the regular floor. Okay. Um, there is two people walking towards the building right now. They seem to be just like looking at the gravestones. Mm hmm. But I'm not really sure. They both have flashlights. It's a, uh, it's a girl in a dress and there's a guy. Um, a girl in a dress. Okay. Should we be worried? What if it's them? Uh, I can't really make, I can't, I can't see them too well yet. I, I don't know. It could even be them. Oh, wait. What? The dude's holding something. What is he holding? Ben? What is he holding? Bro, bro he has a gun. Okay, I am getting back. He has a fucking gun. Jess? Yeah. They're coming in? Yeah, he is walking towards he's walking towards the back door right now. All right, I am in hide, the way back. Hide, yeah, hide. The, uh, I know I'm behind the fucking ski do thing. Okay. Um I'm I'm hiding, okay. I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. Text me, text me. Goodbye. Okay. Change of plans. Uh we're gonna go dark. Not for a while. Just 
this is not good, guys.
shotgun. I heard like a shotgun cock. And whoever that was was a woman in a blue and red dress. So we know. And they were, first off, they were like in socks. Like no shoes, just socks. So if they're comfortable enough to do that, they probably might own this. Um, I was sitting right here in this little cubicle. And when I tried getting up, this slid, because it was against that, it slid. It made a really loud sound. I was scared that they heard me. But I think they might have left already, because there was no way they didn't hear that thing. Is I'm going to go try to get Ben and get the hell out of here. I'm just worried now, because I know they have a gun. Ow. And I just want to make sure that, like, if anything, I'll just be like, don't shoot, don't shoot. I don't know. I was sweating. I was so scared. That was over there. Bro. Bro, these are shotgun shells. This person would have killed us. They would have shot us on sight. I'm just maybe, maybe it was them. I don't know. This was a whole part. Oh Freaking out right now. What just happened? You heard the gun? The, yeah, I heard that. Yeah, yeah. That was a shotgun. There's shotgun shells literally upstairs in a church. They would have killed us in a church. If I go through all, oh my god. <sighs> Wait, bro, that door's covering something. That wood is covering the door. You see that, right? Bro, small town hidden secrets. Remember. Is it the time though? I, I have to at least know what's in there. Cause bro, I heard I heard them. Jeez, they're gone. They're gone? Okay. They we out. waited a while, so. We did. Okay. Where did you hide? It was back there. Oh. In that creek. Bro. There's something back there. I don't know, but maybe, maybe not right now, bro. We have lights on. I, there's something back there, bro. I don't know what it is. I'm worried because remember, that person, you said that you saw a blue and red dress. Yeah. They came upstairs and then they were barefoot. They had just socks on. So clearly they're comfortable enough to be in this position. They had a gun. Now I'm wondering. What if those people are storing their shit here? I found a note. Read this. Lord, pr please protect my family from the demonic presence in the city. They are people who claim to praise your word, but are Lucifer in disguise. Please help our family and town. Jesus. Ben, we're in church. You got that one for me. <laughs> <laughs> How many Hail Marys have to stay for that one? I don't know. Oh. Bro, I'm so freaked out. Like, I'm worried that we're just going to walk out there. It's going to be like, they're waiting for us. Because our car is a little bit down there. Did they say anything when they were? Like, bro, they were like almost dead quiet. I had my mic muted for a while, but I unmuted it every now and then because there's this light in the back. And at one point, I just heard, like the, like the shotgun. It was a shotgun, you could tell. The shotgun shells up there. And then, bro, they were like, there was moments they had scissors, and it sounded like they were just kept opening and closing the scissors. The, the scissors are on the thing over there. I saw them. They're 
playing with scissors. Scissors or shotgun? Like. Rock, rock. Here, I'll take that. I don't know. Maybe we should just get out of here. I think our that. intent cuts out. You know, maybe. I don't know. But that it's not, not our thing, I think. Let's just get out of here. So, is it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Look at these church pews. I can't. We can't exit this way because of church pews. Bro, they could definitely see our lights through these windows. Oh, yeah, 150%. If they're out there, they see us. Maybe they saw it. Maybe that's why they came in. Maybe. You said they were out there by the cemetery? Yeah, but it wasn't even like. It wasn't even getting to that point yet. You know? The thing is, it, it got much darker. Then what are you doing? Oh, my God. Okay. And it's one chasing around with that. Yeah, thanks. Alright, let's roll. Um, yeah. Wait, Ben. Shh, shh, shh. Ben, camera, camera, camera. Um, yo. You hear that? And one thing's for certain, Ben. They're armed. Yeah. We're not. Oh, yeah. I mean, I have a small knife. Oh, okay. Yeah. Bring your knife to a gunfight. Yeah, that's it. Should we just run out there and be like, hey, listen, like, sorry. Like, please don't show. I, I don't know. If it, if it, it depends on who owns this place. If it's someone else. Yeah. yeah. True to protect it. Oh! That was like a warning shot. I think they know we're in here. I think they know we're in here. Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I really don't know. Guys back there. Uh, I mean, well, what other choice do we have at this point? Yeah. What's the warning shot? Do we walk out and try to talk to them? I don't. I don't know, bro. I really don't know. Like death, huh? All right, let's go. Let's go. I'm. I'm hiding. I. Uh, Do we, do we call it, the city doesn't even have a police department, bro. Like, know, it has a sheriff's right. department. You're, the only thing we get to is... Alright. Uh, can we try to exit? Oh, you can't, oh my god. Yeah, we're, we're screwed, bro. We are screwed. 